Hey there game makers and welcome back to another remake Undertale, well once again in Game Maker and today we're gonna do a really quick video just for blinking the whole thing because let's face it we got our heart but um, we want to indicate once we are for example clipping one of those things so we're colliding with it then we are starting to blink then once the blinking is over well um, then the state of getting hit can be redone also but for today we're just gonna do the first part just the blinking part not the collisions so this is where we left off last time we just go on to our player heart and add a create event because we need a few variables which we need to add nothing too fancy so first of all for our blinking a timer which is running down and then once it's running down we just reset it to this value which is i don't know 10 steps so we got this blinking part and the second is i store that into a variable because well why not kind of an alpha value which we're hitting so for for example right now our alpha is one and then we're just checking once the timer is running down hey what kind of alpha are you having if you have well one which is the default one set it to the 0 0.4 and if not well set it to one because we want to reset it to its former glory so let's go into um, that thing and then uh well blinking and do the code it's super simple so this is just an additional way so let's say for example we have this one variable which we want to run down so minus minus and then we're just always checking hey is it like smaller than zero because at some point it will be then we just reset the value and for now what well, nothing is happening we're just you know running down this and then this is kind of looping uh not the most practical thing so we need another check so we're just saying like hey if image alpha is it one so basically is it the default value then we actually do something there we go then we just say like hey set our image alpha to this one variable which or one value which is 0 0.4 and then well that's pretty much it and then else and let's get rid of this one i was a little bit too fast here then for example if it's not one well we can just copy that and then of course set it here and then well once we run it we got a blinking thing this is pretty much it so as you can see uh, easy peasy thing and then of course we want to bake it into a state which we're gonna do later on so basically um we define a state for now at the very beginning it's actually idle but we just set it to hit so this is kind of a mini state machine but not really so our state is hit just for testing then once we say like hey if we are hit run this whole blinking code and then yeah that's then pretty much the whole code nothing is changing because um, we haven't changed too much we just wrapped it into a state once again it's blinking and then for example once we set the state to idle which is the normal one it won't so that was pretty much it for today's video and the next one we will do what we're gonna do while well, we're gonna do the collisions i wanted to make it short and sweet and then the video will be yeah four minutes four minutes is a good time so next time we will do the collisions and then wrap it into an hour state machine then see you in the next one have a good one one up indie